Hey, it's been about 10 seconds, so that means YouTube has once again hidden that description on you. If you're struggling to find the description, then stay tuned because I'm going to show you how to find it on both desktop and mobile device. It can be tricky. They like to put it in places that are not always obvious. So stay tuned for this entire video and I'll show you exactly how to find it whenever you need it. All right, so here we are on YouTube using a desktop browser. As we can see, the video here is paused. And as we scroll down, we see some stuff that we've been familiar with. It's always kind of been there, but YouTube is constantly kind of tweaking where everything lives. So we got some buttons here. We have the channel there. And then below that, you see this little area here. It's very easy to kind of gloss over this and head into the comments and be like, where's the description? But as you can see down at the bottom here, the very beginning of the description is displayed. You'll also notice that when you hover over this area, it turns a darker gray. So you can actually click anywhere you see that gray and it's going to expand the full description. If anybody is sharing links to an article or an offer or anything like that or additional information where they refer to the description, this is where you're going to be able to find all of that information. So pretty straightforward on desktop, but where do we find it on mobile? Let's take a look. All right, so here we are on mobile. We are on a video and we're trying to find the description. So. You can see you have your video, you have your title, and then you start to scroll down and you see thumbs up and then comments. Uh, it's really easy to overlook where the description is given the display that they provided us. They've kind of tucked it away uh, to kind of make room for more real estate to show video thumbnails and other things and ads at the bottom. You can see the comments, they kind of stand out. If you click on comments, it actually brings up a little slider from the bottom and you can get to all of the comments. But right above that, they barely make the description visible. You'll notice under the title where it says 687 views and hashtag creator fundamentals, you'll see a little more button. Actually, anywhere in this area, if we hold our finger down, you'll see that that entire area turns gray. That whole area is a button. So you can click on that area, which we're going to do, and then it brings up this additional information. Now, we're not quite to the full description yet, but you can start to see the beginning of the description right in the center of the screen. Starting a YouTube channel question, uh, do this, not that. Uh, and then it starts into the actual description. But we're looking for the full description. You want everything. You'll notice in this same section, there's a dot, dot, dot more in the lower right hand corner. This section is going to work the same way where you can simply click on that text anywhere and it's going to expand it for the full description. YouTube is constantly trying to optimize all this space for thumbnails and advertisers and everything else. So some of this stuff gets a little bit hidden, but that's how you actually get to the full description. Then you can click or scroll through rather, and you can see the full description. So again, if you're trying to get to an offer, whether that be the Amazon influencer course or TubeBuddy or whatever it is, this is where you're actually going to be able to find that information. So Pretty straightforward, easy to find once you know what you're looking for and you know what it is that YouTube is trying to do in terms of tucking these things away. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, consider clicking the subscribe button so you're alerted to future videos and I'll see you in the next video.